Guyanese are my real Guyanese. Guyanese are my true Guyanese. Let me see you want them up in the year if you know say you're proud say you are Guyanese. Full of stamina for rock, me go show you that it's your girl Nestor. Watch, 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 watch. Let me take you into my world with GBE TV and with some of the people who make the good body girl who she is today. Let me introduce you to Paul and I Mark Production at Compton Tracks Records. Come on, come on, let's go. Follow the good body girl, man. Come on. Wait, wait, wait. Come follow me. <laughs> my world. And this is my producer, producer Mark. And guess what? So I've been working with Mark for the past five years, and I, I would safely say that I found my niche when we started to work together as a team because you know teamwork make the dream work. And let me give you a closer glimpse to what we um, work together and produce as a masterpiece. Right on your screen. There it is. And that's the whole good body girl scene, yeah? Because Nesta is a good body girl. Big up to producer Mark. Big up to producer Mark at Comfort Tracks Records. And let me tell you something. This studio is basically like my home. I would say this is my home. You know why? Because I get a voice. I get to record. I get to be myself. I basically get to evolve into becoming this good body girl with confidence and because of that you're able to get to see into my world of what i do and this is how basically it all comes together sometimes i would listen to the track and i start like vibing it's a vibe because uh, nesta and mark got the vibe thing going on that when he played them them keys let me tell you something you see these keys eh, so there's some proper stuff in the world. clink 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 hang <laughs> he bad like that he bad 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 like that but i've been working with mark as a recording artist and it has been a wonderful journey and i can say basically that all the songs that you guys love my fans is body calling so far palm and chi bam bam every every single thing that y'all love don't waste my time would be like my newest release that will be out on my ep very 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 soon <laughs> so guess what into this world Nesta's world you're gonna love everything that you're seeing everything that you're hearing it's all about here is where I make all the mistakes if you ain't making no mistake then friend sis bro auntie everybody then you can reach greatness this is the place for you to make all your mistakes and get it perfect so i will do all my this is the the lovely boot let me give you a view of the lovely boot <laughs> so i i basically have enough room to make i basically have enough room to make all the mistakes because here is where i become the perfectionist I would hear when I make mistakes, and that's not a bad thing. As an entertainer, I make mistakes here in the booth, in the studio, the entire building, while I'm recording. And when I would hear these mistakes, I would stop and be like, uh, I ain't like that. And that comes with experience, because if you really want to reach greatness, you have to put in that work. It, sometimes it comes easily, and, and sometimes it doesn't. But keep working, keep working, keep working, and that's how come I'm who I am today. And this is the lovely boot. Y'all know why I'm so excited about this boot. This boot is make I express myself the way I really want to. So what, what if I'm singing a love song? I get to show it here. If, if I'm doing a nice seductive song, I would say everything is done in this wonderful boot. This is my safe space. This is my space where I get to really bloom shine be myself so i want to big up to gbe tv all day every day because it lit so ensure you subscribe to my vivo channel nesta vivo subscribe to gbe tv follow company tracks records on instagram 
Compen Tracks Records. Follow me on Instagram at Nesta underscore music. Follow me on Facebook at Nesta Music. Make me explore. Make me feel alive. Watching in the streets, and I'm your host. Today, my special guest is 
recording, international recording artist, Nesta, producer Mark. Mm -hmm. Nesta, home of all home, right? Yes, my favorite place. <laughs> okay, here to say, we're going to start with Mark, right? Let me start with Mark today. Mark, what's going on, sir? Good, good. There, there. Mark Production. Everything good. Located in New Jersey, right? Yeah. 1739 Springfield Avenue, Maplewood, New Jersey. Repeat that one more time for the people there, Mark. 1739 Springfield Avenue, Maplewood, New Jersey. And your phone number, because email or something. 973-536-7733. All right, people. Mark. Email producer Mark at gmail.com. That's it. Simple. Need tracks, whatever. Email me. All right. Send me a text. So. Let, 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 let me ask the people. Mark, um, what part is plant you from, sir? Let people let them know where you're repping. Uh, say again? What part of the planet you from? Oh, Guyana. <laughs> Guyana? Definitely Guyana. <laughs> you know what I'm what's, what's, give me a couple of artists that you work with that well known. Mm. Uh, well, of course I work with. I basically work with a lot of local artists. S sir, Nesta is not local, sir. I mean, artists. From, <laughs> arti listen, let, let me rephrase it. I work with a lot of artists from my country, Guyana. Okay. You know what I'm saying? The big ones that you know, I work with them. Okay. Most of them. You know. mm. I, li I left there a while now, so I ain't really know the young ones, but mm -hmm. most of the old ones, I work with them. Okay. Um, yeah. At what age you found music or music from you? Uh, yeah, I was probably playing music since I was, what, 13, 14 in church. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I, was the, I used to go to this Baptist church, Golden Grove Baptist Church from Golden Grove. Wait, you're from Golden Grove? Yeah, I used, well, I'm from Golden Grove, but mm -hmm. I grew up in Golden Grove. Oh, well, my mother is from Golden Grove. Maybe you oh. know my mother. You know my uncle Meche? Meche know everybody. Meche. Son, son. I know the name. Yeah, yeah, my uncle know everybody. I must know the name there. Yeah, but that's where you start, you know. Okay. The old music thing. Golden Grove Baptist Church, big up. So, what what is it with a lot of people who start in church and and then take the next direction? Like, like... Uh, you, you get my question? Or? That's a good question. <laughs> no, seriously, I interview a lot of artists. Now I'm into interviewing a, um, a pro producer. And a lot of people start in church. Like, a lot of talented people start in church. True that. W what's up with that? What do you think of that? Like, you get this talent from church, and then we all go to that. <laughs> I, 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 would pro I would probably, I mean, from back then, mm -hmm. when in terms of music of itself, there was a little scope for me for uh, playing music in church mm -hmm. and actually branching out from church to the world. To the world, right, right. There, there wasn't a big scope to really get out. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So that's why most of us leave the church and went and play in string bands just to get out. Okay. Get okay. to the world. You know okay. Okay. Sh show your talent differently. Yeah. Okay. That's basically what, what that was. Mm -hmm. So you're living in Jersey now, studio in Jersey. Yeah. Um, or you link up with Nesta. What what you what you could remember about about yeah <laughs> I could remember mm -hmm. I used to play in the boys band we used to practice in Haslington mm -hmm. and I know Nesta mother for a while for for a long time you know what I'm saying and I could remember um, doing stuff with Nesta when she was small mm. I really could <laughs> but then. <laughs> <laughs> After she hit me up on Facebook, I don't know, she's going to tell you all the story. Mm -hmm. Oh, she hit me up on Facebook and then uh -huh. I'm looking at it, I'm like, so you don't remember me? <laughs> and then I realized it's Nesta time. Because she grew, she, you know, she, okay. different person. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Mm. So that's basically the story of me and Nesta. All right, cool. Well, what, well we talk to Nesta, then ask Nesta a few questions. <laughs> okay. Nesta. <laughs> Let me continue from right there where Mark left off. The, the link up, the link up. Well, <laughs> well, I was nine years old mm -hmm. when uh, Mark, when I met Mark, and he was playing the very him. first time. Yes, and um, oh gosh, and at that time, I used to be doing cover music. Me, myself, and my brother. Big up to my brother Mark Batson, and my mom used to keep this Christmas annual Christmas concert for Golden Grove Secondary School, which is the school I later attended um, years after. And every Christmas she would 
either hire um the boys band or mischievous guys band so when i met mark um he was like when i started this thing like he could sing but why open up some more like open your mouth some more right and i start opening and as i as i keep opening my mouth he's like yes yes this is what i'm talking about and then he look at my mom and he's like oh you got a little star coming up you know and she's like yeah what? man yeah man so mark put it in the universe yes <laughs> <laughs> you remember that story uh, mark, I don't story. mark don't remember nothing mm -hmm. so um years um passed by and i was like the name keep coming because every time i heard the song TikTok on the radio, everybody was like, you know, say, is Mark Walker do this song? I was like, for real? I go in and TikTok look for you. TikTok by um, Adrian. Oh, yeah. I work with them, yeah. Yes. Okay. So I was like, wait, I know Mark. Like, I used to I used to sing in the band when Mark used to play. And everybody's like, man, you know Mark. I said, I know, I know Mark. So I went on Facebook now, because you know your girl become a big social media sensation. <laughs> you know. And, and since I learned to use the um the phone and them things, like back then, you know, I, I started a little iTech phone and so. So when I get an iTech phone now, I decided I'm going to type in Mark Walcott and I look in, look in, look in. I see a couple of people. But then the one that stand out to me is the image because I remember that Mark face never changed. <laughs> Mark still you look young the same way I know him how much years ago. So when I hit him up, I was like, hey Mark, what's up and thing? He's like, hi, you know, you know, Mark very easy going and thing. Then I was like, you can't remember me? Mm. He's like, nah. I was like, man, the little girl we used to sing in the band when they get Christmas concert and thing. And he's like, wait, um, or Nesta, teacher, butcher, daughter. I was like, yeah, it's me. He's like, oh, shocks, you look different, girl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <That's true. laughs> you remember the part, Mark? <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, yeah, man, I, I'm singing now and thing. This time, I'm so excited that he replied to me. Let me tell you, so it was a big thing because I've been haunting for this man for years. Like, I've been haunting for Mark since I was 13 because I think when Mark left Ghana, I was 13. So I've been looking for Mark since 13, even though I did not face. Facebook then I try on a little MySpace thing it didn't walk in but I couldn't find Mark until I discovered Facebook when I got older and when I was coming to America in 2015 they all excited that I got That's to your first time. yeah I okay. got to come and look for Mark and then I had there's a producer I work with back home as well big up to Vijay Diolal he's like I said hey you must tell Mark put in a word for me now that I come into America and he must look out for me and everything you know you know them ways so and that's exactly how it went and that's how we continue working okay. after then i just um it Name was just magical working with Ooh. i would say my my first biggest track working with mark is body calling yeah that was the first one yeah, give them a sample of that song yeah. my body it's a calling you uh -huh. your body it's a calling mine eh. me see your whole on tight me got your pan locked down every night <laughs> Everything that you're longing for may have it right there. Go girl. I won't intercept, just come closer. Take care of me. Mm -hmm. Kissing on my lips down to my navel. All the way down there, kissing on my sweet pie pie. Let me show you how I move for you. Looking at me, ay ay ay. Wanna reverse for you, fling it up for you. Choo 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 <laughs> Nesta, Guyana International Recording Artist. Thank you. <laughs> you guys watching the behind the scene anyway, okay? If you didn't know, Nesta Studio, Mark, well, home of Nesta. Yes. Studio this, owned by Mark and my, Paul, right? My favorite place. Let me tell you, this is mm -hmm. home away from home. I feel very confident, very comfortable, very comfortable, very happy. I basically get to be myself here at Compin Tracks Records. And look, Mark, let me ask you a question. Since she said that right there, is that your goal to make the artists them feel as this is their home, this is the way they should be? Uh, I guess. Yeah, basically that, that that's what it is. And that's what it is. Like every artist, link up Mark if you want to get the the, the, the thing sung and right out there, right? Definitely. One more time, Mark. Give them your info. Oh, producer Mark at gmail.com and uh, my number is 973-536-7733. Ernesta, okay, Ernesta. 
Mm-hmm. Talk to the people there. So ensure that you follow me on Instagram at Nesta underscore music. Follow Comp and Tracks Records on Instagram. Follow me on Facebook, Nesta Music. And make sure you book the good body, y'all. Send, send that email to GBETV all day, every day. Mm-hmm. All right. You, you did more than one song with, with Mark. Yes, I did. What's it? Well, give, give them another sample of another song that you did with Mark. What are you doing? I, I want to them here. How Mark production sound great. What are you doing? I mean, Biddy Bam Bam Bam. It's so catchy. <laughs> You see, I, I asked him the question, and uh, he, my did, bad, my he bad. didn't even catch uh, my it. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. I should I should have picked up on that, people. That is my fault. She did ask the question, right? <laughs> <laughs> you trouble woman. Uh, so yes. beat the bam bam. Of course. Bam on she bam bam, lashing it like a drum roll. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Beating palm and she bam bam, lashing it like a drum roll. Start moving fingers and she bam bam, pa you gotta get it back up, bam bam. Crap, <laughs> she bam bam. Whoa, nice sexy. Bam bam. <laughs> and she have a thing, you know. <laughs> yeah, people, it's behind the scene. GBTV, Nesta, guy in the recording, international artist, Mark. Mm-hmm. That's what it is, all day, every Guyani is all my real Guyani. Guyani is all my true Guyani. Let me see you one them up in the year. If you know, say you're broke. GBE TV. Yes,